like it? And how did everyone look? Are we stealing stuff from it? Is it problematic? It's brunch movie reviews. The Shape of Water is about a fish thing with no voice but trying to fuck someone on land. Liked it better the first time when it was called Little Mermaid. <laughs> Where, so uh, Sally Hawkins plays a uh, a mute yes. uh, who begins to smash a weird kind of fish man. And we learn that mutes, you know the the old adage about uh, girls always talking shop with their lady friends. You know, they, they discuss everything. Yeah. Even the mutes. Yeah. Because they, first thing she, she's TikTok. like, she signs to to her to Octavia Spencer, like, let me tell you about this dick. <laughs> and, and then she like she explains where like how the dick how came the about. dick was presented. I still really wasn't completely sure how that. She worked. made it seem like, like it seemed like, like it was like a bed like that goes up into the wall. <laughs> yes, and then, exactly. Then just like drop down. Well, and it's like dick. It seemed like that there was like something covering it up that it like from which it emerged. Yes. Which sounds lovely. I like this movie a lot for all of those reasons. <laughs> no, I liked the, this movie a lot. I was interested the whole way. Uh, it had the secret weapon of all movies, which is to have Octavia Spencer as a supporting yeah. actress because it that movie, it's... Automatic a- Oscar bit. What did you give it for? Did you like it? Did we like it out of... Four, I give it a uh, 3.4. Hey, same score as me. Really? Yes, 3.4 out of 4. So you liked it. I liked it a lot. Yeah. I thought it was a really good movie. Um, probably my favorite part of this movie was like the set design. It yeah. It was unbelievable. Yeah. Uh, like it was really its own little world. Mm-hmm. And it felt like, uh, and everything was just like so perfectly shot yeah uh, i do hope that this wins for production because yeah it's nominated for for that so. well what oh well you know what's gonna fucking win dunkirk fucking dunkirk because the they use real ships <laughs> oh shut the fuck up about the real goddamn ships yeah i mean i have i have that in my category mm. uh how did everyone look i said muggle shannon as a villain Mm, Italian chef kissing his fingers. Oh, I. He is just the perfect villain. Yeah, and especially in a with the candy. Oh, oh <laughs> yes, like all of his mannerisms. Yeah, it's just so great as a villain. Also, I had uh, Michael Stuhlbarg. Anytime Michael Stuhlbarg's in anything, yeah, it's so satisfying for some reason. Uh, the fish was gross. <laughs> yes, would not smash. The fish did not look good. Sally Hawkins uh, is a real, uh, she's a, a, a real sweetheart. That uh, Yeah, she bit the bullet on that one. He, he must have been funny. <laughs> uh, I gave looks to a 1.6 out of 2. Uh, I'll give it a uh, 1.8 out of 2. Okay. Uh, are we stealing anything from it? Again, I'd like to steal uh, whatever that penis situation <laughs> is. Uh, I had a straight zero out of two for stealing stuff from it. I don't know. I one. I don't know. I don't think that I could steal anything from this. But even if there was something that I'd steal from it, I think that I would give it a zero out of two anyway, simply because this movie stole some stuff from other other uh, pieces of pop culture that I watched this year, such as such the as Little Mermaid. Such as a Little Mermaid. I did not watch that this year, but that's not it. yet. You haven't not gotten around yet. to your yearly viewing uh, yet. The the little monster thing ate the head off a cat. Mm-hmm. Mm. I remember when I watched Sa- Stranger Things season two. Number two, this is not the only Sally Hawkins movie this year. Uh, Where she's naked, Paddington two. <laughs> she was not naked in Paddington two. I don't know. Maybe you might see it again. <laughs> Deleted scenes. Get around that good screening. Yet. Yeah. <laughs> um, this is not the only Sally Hawkins movie this year or that I've seen recently in which a character floods a bathroom and then just starts swimming in the bathroom. You know what? But to be fair, I thought that when I saw Paddington 2, so Paddington 2, Jack's Shape of Water. Was that Paddington 2 in which he floods the bathroom? Yeah. Right? I think it's Paddington 1. I think it's Paddington 1 because that was like when they first brought him home the first night. Uh, he like was trying to figure out how the shit in the bathroom worked, and oh. he ended up flooding it all. Um, so oh, so if it's Paddington so one, then yeah, then the Shape of Water jacked that. Yeah, okay. So uh, zero out of two for stealing stuff, but very problematic movie. So maybe I'll have to deduct points as well for being a problematic movie because it steals. It's a ripoff. I'm giving it a one because. 
this is something I'd like to steal, but I know I won't. And that's why it gets bumped down to one. Uh, I always liked that uh, Dave Grohl always chews gum when he's playing. I always thought it was cool that every time you see Dave Grohl on stage, he's chewing gum. And when he's singing, he's chewing gum. It's casual and I, look. And it's just like a cool kind of look. And I remember thinking, like, I wish I had some kind of thing like that where, like, oh, Deej, he's always doing this. And it's not like a thing that you're forcing on anyone, but it's just like a very subtle kind of cool thing. And Michael Shannon had that with the candy. Well, now I you are going to say something else. Now, he goes a little far with it because he talks about the candy a lot. Mm -hmm. Michael, honey. No one wants to hear about the candy. So, in fact, I won't give it a straight one. I'll give it a point nine. Um, was it problematic? Again, it's it's so wild and so like it, it's problematic because like you can't be fucking that fish, lady. <laughs> yes. <laughs> my my one note under problematic is she fucks a fish, man. Yeah, I like, can't can't be. We're not fucking fishes. <laughs> this is obviously a a world where weird stuff's going on, but no one's telling you that like fish fucking is one of those <laughs> no. things. Um. Also, kind of problematic, uh, Richard Jenkins, love yourself the way you are. You don't need to dwell on the hair thing. You don't. He didn't like the fish guy until he gave him his hair back. I did not like, uh, there was a problematic portion of this movie that I did not like. What? Uh, Octavia Spencer uh, said that she doesn't trust little people. Really? Yeah, she said that she, uh, she says that short people are mean, and it must be the air down there. I I that love that. <laughs> found that very offensive. I am for sure going to use that a lot. Uh, it must be the air down there. Which is kind of a hilarious way of twisting the, uh, hey, how's the weather up there? Right. You just be like, yeah, put it on the, the little short people. I like the idea of it being something about the air down there because imagine if like short people were walking around just being assholes like, hey, what's up? You still... <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> oh, fuck you. Yeah, fucking weird shit. But it was it problematic? I didn't really. Yeah, you can't be fucking the fish. Um, so <laughs> yeah, I gave this one a uh, a point two five. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a point. I'm gonna give it a point six. I, I mean, like you can't fuck a fish, and also just like spoiler alert, the ending of just her getting shot and then like dragged down into the sea. Yeah. For a life underwater. Yeah. Oh no, she fucking drowned right away. Yeah, I don't understand. No, because she. No, that's not true because her uh, scars. Oh yeah, that's right. You gave her gills. gills. Yeah. Okay. Uh, she... I don't need. Uh, I don't need dumb, dumb children jumping into the sea and drowning because they watch The Shape of Water and they just think they're gonna sprout gills from this magical fuck fish. Uh, let's add them up. No way. It shouldn't have been so fucking problematic. What the fuck? Yeah, man, my score is way lower than I think reflects how I feel yeah. about this movie. But that's, again, that's what this rating system is. Yeah. It surprises Those you. Those are the rules. I didn't write them. Yeah. <laughs> we did. But, <laughs> uh, what'd you have? 6.7. I had even worse. I had a 5.25. Oh, my God. I yeah, know. that's... That, that is... That's tough, that's man. That's incorrect. Yeah, that's... Like, I heard everything you said, though, and everything you said was <laughs> yeah. right and made sense. <laughs> it's just the way it's... That's the way it goes, man. Man, Shape of Water, the hard luck loser this year's brunch's uh, rating. Brunch, hit it, boys! <laughs>